But people like us that dealt with this, they'll throw us away like a piece of trash. I couldn't afford an attorney to fight for me. It shouldn't be about economics or stature that you get this stuff. It shouldn't be about what the factors were, and that's it. I wasn't expecting to go that day to go to a war zone. Not by any means. I wasn't expecting to watch that guy bleed out right in front of me at that window. I don't understand. But they didn't give me the chance to come back. Talking to my therapist, I had two different ones. I was trying to go to eye therapy to get that treatment done. I'm doing DBT now. I still go twice a week. I mean, but I, I can't afford it. I have a wife that's bluffing. And if it wasn't for her, I would be in the streets. It, it sucks. Like, I don't know what else to say right now. It's like, <laughs> like nightmares, like you don't sleep. I mean, I take so much medication, it's not even funny. Like, I don't know. I do what the doctors tell me to do. That's what I do. Like, but the guilt, that's never going to go away. I don't know how. They say it's radical acceptance, radical acceptance. But why me? I was right there.